Look at the body, the belly, yeah, the belly. Oh this, man, look this, at the physique, yeah. This me at 48 when I, yeah. when I said, you know what man, let me just go in the gym out back. And have a, be like, yeah, yeah T1, put the body on, man. Let me just see if I still got it. <laughs> that's it. That's this sort of clip. The body, the physique, it's not, it's not no, there. It's not there. And he's southwards, yeah. so he's going to get mashed with that right hand. He's going to get mashed with that yeah. right hand. At least he's getting some change, man. He's getting, that's <laughs> what, an Uber all driver, I saw. Is that real or oh, not? I don't know if he's yeah. an Uber driver for real, but he's going to make some change. Yeah. But we've got a couple of questions. I put something on the story. I said, is there anything it, anyone wants to ask? Um. What has been the biggest challenge of trying to become successful in your 20s? Um, it's Understanding that you need to sacrifice. Yeah, maybe that. Yeah, yeah. you have to yeah. sacrifice. Yeah, I'll agree with you. If you want to be successful in your twenties, mm. that means you have to say no sometimes yeah. to the parties. Yeah, if you drink alcohol to the alcohol. Yeah. You have to be disciplined. You need to understand mm. that in order to be successful, you have to give it your all. It's the power of sacrifice mm -hmm. of learning. If I don't do this now, I can do it yeah. later. It's the belief of like everyone's doing what they want to do now, isn't it? Yeah. In your twenties, especially up to twenty-five, I think. Yeah. It's, it's, it's not just, short term. Every yeah, short term. Everything short term. The long term. Holidays. Yeah. You're, you're spending. Like everything is like cool, man. I can do it now. Yeah. I'm doing it now. Then you gotta hit this point where you're like, at thirty, I'm gonna be broke. You know what it is? If I don't. The do parties it. are not going nowhere. Yeah. That the, the IB for trips, the party holidays, they're, they're not, not going, going nowhere. nowhere. No. The design away, it's not going nowhere. No. And you know I'm saying so get your 20s right, your 30s will be good. Play around in your 20s, mm. you're gonna have to do catch up in your 30s. Some people wanna some people up. wanna play in their 30s. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hundred. Catch up in your 40s. Yeah. Then you've got a bad back in your 50s, you're done. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you're done. You're done. No, <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's true. It's true. I'm excited, bro. I'm excited. I don't know if you can see it on my face. <laughs> what? I'm excited. Putting in the work. Putting in the work. Gonna get the result. For show. Sure. Body's in a good place. Yeah. Just have to wake up, just do my morning yeah. motions. Well, yeah, that's it. Habit, innit? Yeah. Get to the habit. Do my morning motions, do my yoga, and like any anything I'm doing, just relax. Yeah. Just let your body do it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Someone asked when when we're gonna get Gib on the podcast. I think that's been overdue, bro. Yeah, we have to ask him. That's, that's been, been overdue. Asking, yeah. That's been overdue. Yeah. We have to get him on there. We have to get him on there. Mm -hmm. um, Everyone wants to hear what Big Gib is doing, man. No, he's for real, say. right? People act, and I'm I feel saying. like he'll only talk to us about it <laughs> as well. To <laughs> yeah. be fair, I don't think yeah. anyone could call him call him on the podcast, and then he'll he'll chat to them. Yeah. Why do some influencers have big followings on socials but can't sell tickets or pay per view? Dormant. Followers, in it, dormant followers. Yeah, and sometimes it just doesn't transfer over like that. I mean, in terms of ticket sales, it's easy to understand that because me following you requires no effort. Yeah, it's in my hand. Here. Yeah, I don't need to Google Maps where your fight is. I don't need to buy a ticket. Mm -hmm. I don't need to see who's gonna roll with me. Yeah, all these things are not factors to follow and like. Yeah, so the following and liking bit, yeah. It doesn't, it's not necessarily going to relate to ticket sales. Pay-per-views is a more where it should kind of matter because it's still convenient yeah. to click. Mm. It's just whether you got the bread or not. But then everyone also wants to find a yeah. stream, innit? But it's also, also, you can look at it like if these so-called big influencers decided to launch merch 
how much people support and buy their merch. That's another indication, isn't it? Mm, Are these yeah. people really with me? Yeah, you know what I'm saying? that's a good way. Yeah. And then I went with my missus, uh, my birthday, just gone. Oh, you was there? Yeah. Oh, sh Wait, everyone's hit Morocco, you know? I wonder why. <laughs> Last question, out of all the world title belts, how would you rank them from most prestigious to least prestigious? Number one, WBC, I'll see. Yeah, w WBA, I might put WBA. WBA over WBC? Yeah, I might put WBA first. Because it was there first. I think, yeah, but see me growing up watching boxing. Yeah, it was the WBC. The belts that have was WBC. It was, it was. And I you think it still is. It's, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, it is, it is. It, it is. Maybe we used to throw away the other belts, keep the WBC. Yeah. The, growing up and watching Passing fighting, the WBC. WBC. But the WBA, I would say, is the most prestigious because it was here before. Yeah. But mm -hmm. I'd say the WBC is the yeah. one that that's the one day I would like to mm -hmm. to have that belt because that's just the belt, isn't it? Yeah. Like, that's the belt. But the WBA, WBC, then probably IBF and then WBO. I'll probably put WBO last out of the four. Now, yeah, WBO will have to be last. Yeah, now IBF is sort of holding more weight. Yeah. And I think the people that are holding the IBF are more Co certified than, than the WBO, WBO champions. WBO champions, yeah. Yeah. Um, so I'll go... I'll go WBA, not out of my personal like thing. WBA, WBC, IBF, WBO. Yeah, I'm um, WBC, WBA, WBA, yeah, WBA, yeah. IBF, WBO. Nice and light, like an ninja. Yeah, boom, boom, up. Good. See when people think of skipping, people just think, oh, it's good cardio. But you know what it does? It strengthens your veins to send the blood back to your heart. You know what I'm saying? I didn't know that. See, because you can get like, see like people with varicose veins and whatnot, blood yeah. clotting in their veins. It's because their veins are weak, it's not sending the blood back to the heart. Because remember, the artery pumps blood away from the heart, then the veins bring it back. So, yeah. So I was thinking, I wonder if the person who thought about skipping had that in mind. answered a few questions next week we'll be back in the gym working as you know the 31st of march is when we defend the english title in o2 arena against Mikel lawal 
make sure you grab your tickets the link is in the description and yeah man we'll have some more questions as well we'll put it out again and we'll answer a few every week we'll do it hope you enjoy it love to my people bless people thank you for supporting our journey like and subscribe and we'll all see of how that. much we'll thank you <laughs> when we drop this much <laughs> <laughs> no but love people bless <laughs> Thank you.